exercise talisman sabre is a large exercise. Within that is exercise hammer, which is the army's exercise. That's a certification for the third brigade as the brigade out of Townsville, as which is now Australia's ready brigade. Uh, we are required to meet certain requirements for the Australian Army to make sure that we, we are ready to go. Uh, most importantly is our coalition interoperability. So we're really pleased to have the United States and New Zealand here today. And we're pleased that our soldiers can have the opportunity to work with a vast array of equipment uh, to make sure that we can employ that equipment uh, into the best effect possible. Talisman Sabre is an excellent uh, builder of readiness, multinational readiness and uh, unilateral readiness within the United States Army. Uh, working with the Australian Defence Forces uh, is absolutely critical to strengthening our partnerships uh, throughout the PACOM AOR. Primarily Talisman Sabre is a bilateral exercise between the US and Australia uh, and New Zealand has been invited along on the exercise by the Australians to uh, join in and be part of the uh, third brigade, primarily part of the third brigade combat team. Uh, but we've also got uh, naval assets, the HMNZS Canterbury, part of the naval strike group and also uh, a couple of helicopters working as part of the aviation battle group. It is a fantastic training opportunity which we cannot generate in New Zealand. Uh, so the opportunity to come along and be part of something of this size uh, and when the exercise is focused at the mid-intensity war fighting, um, yeah, it is a fantastic opportunity. So hopefully we'll continue to receive those invitations in the future. Being able to train with our coalition partners, our you know, closest allies with the Australians, uh, brings about a level of readiness uh, that, that is not achievable anywhere else. Uh, we, we get the opportunity in the States to, uh, you know, train in the desert, deserts of California, the woodlands of Louisiana, the mountainous and uh, freezing Arctic conditions in Alaska, but being able to train uh, somewhere that is not, that you're not accustomed to um, brings a, a level of readiness and confidence uh, that the soldiers just would not get anywhere else. Coming in, in, in our particular area within Shoulder Bay, uh, the, the standard array of Australian equipment combined with US and New Zealand equipment means that we really have a great opportunity to, to educate our soldiers to, to the modern way of war and to understand how coalition operations work. Do it.